It all started in February when I bought myself a van for Valentine's Day. An empty cargo van that I plan to convert into my home. Converting a van in a pandemic was indeed challenging. But after six months of work on the van, I'm almost ready to take off into Western Canada. Cette semaine, j'étais pour une randonnée dans la forêt boréale. C'était tellement beau. a lot more on my van tables this week. These tables are really a labor of love. Used a router on the table that's going to go between my front seats and made some legs that we stuck on with glue and velcro. This table is going to come apart for me to use on traveling days. I'll be able to put things on there instead of on the passenger seat. working on a table and a cutting board for my van uh, so I bought this old table from a camper and now I'm converting it to fit my van so I'll show you what I got I'm just staining it now there's gonna be epoxied and there's gonna be sparkles in it I found this stain that's pretty much the same color as my floor Je les aime tellement mes tables. J'ai vraiment hâte de vous montrer qu'est-ce que ça a l'air dans la van la semaine prochaine. Evenings are getting much cooler. It's pretty much fall time now. So my heater's running all night and I find that it's pretty hard on my batteries. So I decided to install shore power so I can sometimes plug into other people or campgrounds power. So that meant another hole in my van. My cousin Dennis, the solar guy, helped me out with this, even though drilling through my van is not his favorite thing. Our measurements, this should be... Making hole a hole in my perfectly. It should be there. So 
show you, I'ma, I'ma, I'ma show you what I want. I'ma show you, I'ma show you what I'm working with. Hey, I'ma show you, I'ma, I'ma, I'ma show you what I want. I'ma show you, I'ma show you what I'm working with. Hey, I'ma show you, I'ma, I'ma, I'ma show you what I want. I'ma show you. C'était pas mal épeurant de faire un autre trou dans ma vanne, mais je suis très contente des résultats. Testing out the shore power and enjoying all the power I need for tonight. So I'm plugged in at my cousin Dennis's camper on his generator so I don't have to worry about my batteries dying throughout the night with my heater that takes up a lot of power. That's been happening quite a bit. So I'm all boosted up, 14.477 amps. Même s'il fait encore chaud le jour, le soir, c'est froid. Faut admettre que l'été est fini, puis c'est le temps de partir. Join me next week for the conclusion of my build and for plans for my future. <laughs>